the Yankee captain. Aaron, to come out here this series and essentially take care of business, what position does this set you guys up for with the race coming into town? No, that's where we want to be. You know, we wanted to come in here and take care of business at home. And, you know, we, you know, every team in the big leagues, no matter what their record is, it's a good ball club. And you got to, you know, go out there and, and win every game. And, you know, this is just getting us ready for another big series here with the Rays where, you know, we were kind of back and forth down there at the Trop. And, you know, we're, we're looking forward to it. Second game back from the IL, how would you rate where your timing's at at the plate? We're still working on it. We're still working on it. Um, missing a couple pitches. Uh, but that's... You know, we'll, we'll get there. We'll be. I'll be where I need to be in, in here soon. As a spectator for that last race series, just what did you see from the Yankees? And what did you see from Tampa Bay? How would you evaluate the series? You know, we could have easily been swept that series. You know, we easily could have swept them. You know, it's it was just kind of a back and forth series. You know, they take the lead. You know, we come back. You know, they take it back again. You know, we tie it up. It was just kind of a back and forth series where both teams were really. You know, grinding at bats. You know, guys were getting dirty. Guys were making plays. You know, pitchers stepped up when they needed to. It was, it was a fun series. You know, it's a series you want to play in. So, you know, we're definitely looking forward to the four games we got at home with those guys. Man, it's going to be it's going to be fun. Aaron, how did you describe that rivalry in the time that you've been at the big league club? Yeah, they got a good ball club. You know, it's uh, you know juices kind of flow and those competitive. Um, Juices really get going when you're playing another good team. You know, they got great pitchers. They got a great lineup that's really, you know, not only putting the ball in play, but, you know, doing some damage and, you know, hitting a lot of home runs. So uh, over the years, it's been fun going going toe to toe with those guys. We've seen, in the, we've seen them in the postseason, you know, battles here at home, battles at the Trop. So, you know, we're looking forward to another great series against them. How do you feel that series like this where everybody gets in on the, the offense before heading into a series like that? Yeah, it's, it's it's definitely, you know, helps guys' confidence, you know, and you have a couple good at-bats, you know, put the ball in play. Uh, pitchers kind of stepping up for us, doing the job. So it's, uh, you need those every now and then because baseball's a grind. You know, you're going to have those series where nothing goes right. They're going to have the series where everything goes right and kind of kind of feeling good. So, you know, getting a chance to get contributions from everybody in the lineup and in the rotation and then going into a big series like this is, is going to be good for us. Aaron, what has Harrison's addition done to this offense? He's a spark plug. Man. He's, you know, he's a gold glove center fielder that, you know, he's hustling around the bases, you know, already two triples, you know, past couple games. Um, you know, just his at-bats, his approach at the plate, you know, he goes up there with a the plan, he executes it. You know, it's fun to see that, and, um, you know, he brings that energy, man. You need that, you know, when you're playing 162 and, you know, things aren't going your way. When you have a guy like that in the lineup that can ignite it with a big three-run homer, man, it's, it's special. What did you think of the power Volpe showed today? I was impressive. You know, he kind of he knew right off the bat that I was going to be gone. You know, very few people uh, can take it out to dead center like that and kind of know off the bat that it's going to be gone. So it was uh, impressive, man. He's been hitting the ball hard all all season. You know, I think the the average you see up there isn't right, man. He's he swings the bat well. He has a great approach. You know, just been a little unlucky. So I was pretty happy he got rewarded for that little granny right there. How do you think he's handled that stretch? I'd imagine it's hard for a young player to be hitting the ball hard, but not necessarily getting the results. Well, that's why he's here. You know, is he's a guy that can handle going through the rookie year bumps and bruises that you're going to go through, man. He and he handles it with, you know, he's one of the best I've seen. You know, he never has his head down. Uh, he's never complaining. He's never asking why. He just shows up every single day ready to work. And even if he was over for the night before, man, he's coming out here and, you know, first swing of the day, he's, he's lacing a ball. So it's, it's, uh, it's impressive to see, and it's been fun to be around.